Think. Act. And prosper. You are now tuned in to the Money Level Show. And it seems like Russia's in a corner in a lot of ways, but it seems like they still have a lot of leverage in a lot of ways. Um, and I mean, I, to be honest, I think that Putin could um, do something very drastic, you know, very dangerous to the to the global economy with with how much um, uh, palladium they export, oil, energy, natural gas, um, mm. wheat, um, fertilizer, all those different things, and like you you see all these nations like ganging up on on Russia, and it's like, hey, like I would be you kind of playing with fire, I feel like. <laughs> Yeah, indeed. He has an immense amount of leverage simply by the 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 amount of the, the percentage of their exports that are vital to both global economies, to food production, et cetera. Like you mentioned, fertilizer. Russia is the number one wheat exporter on the planet. Ukraine, I think, is the number five wheat exporter. So there's a lot of speculation already, you know, that there could be um, impl implications for food shortages. And Russia has a big market to the east that's not necessarily cutting them off at this point, you know, China and India, they could be selling fertilizer, natural gas, uh, uranium and rich uranium to these markets as well. Even if uh, they get sanctioned or they cut, cut off exports to the West, you know, they still have a pretty big market to the East. So he's got a lot of leverage here. That's for sure. Mm -hmm.